Hey guys, I'm just making a little uh, video here just to see if I can get someone's help. Um, this is the first time I've ever used a uh, Tsunami uh, Soundtracks decoder and uh, I've never ran into this issue before. Uh, so I've got it hooked up. It, ran, it runs fine. It, uh, it works fine. It gets power fine. If I turn it on, uh, put power to the track, the power light comes on right there. And uh, if I uh, go forward, it goes forward, no problem. If I go backwards, it goes backwards, no problem. And the uh, the LED light that's at the front here, um, let me turn off my light here, see if it looks any better here. Um, so uh, there's no faults. Uh, it's designed to flash um, if it's uh, got a fault. Um, so my next step is um, I'm starting to get the, uh, the wiring all done. Uh, with the LEDs and uh, um, as you can see I've got power um, I just hooked this light up here as a, a tester just to um, try it out I, I got my headlights here all wired up in a series and um, they work too but they weren't working to what I wanted to do what's happening is here let me show you and um, if I push function zero in the hopes that that would technically shut it off, all it does is dim. And uh, um, I don't know if you can see that. It's kind of going dimmer, brighter, dimmer, brighter. And that's all it does. I cannot get this to shut off. Um, and I'm not sure why. I've already changed the settings on the board to tell it that it is going to be an LED and not just a regular light. And um, I've got it hooked up exactly what it says. It says to hook up the um, anode uh, positive lead off the uh, off the LED to the positive, which that's uh, that is that's what the black one is here. And it says to hook the resistor on the positive lead to uh, to the board. So that's exactly how it's hooked up. Um, and uh, that's all I can do. And even if I go into reverse, it won't shut off. It's always on. Like that's in reverse mode now. See, I'll go backwards. And there's going backwards, but it won't shut off. And uh, I've already gone. I'm on the computer. This is actually the quick start guide for uh, the Tsunami decoder. And it doesn't mention anything. Um, doesn't say anything about uh, having this issue. I've already looked it up on Google, cannot find it. And uh, um, if I swap over to my other computer here, just give me a second, go like that. Now this is my decoder, or my programming computer. And there it is. And this is actually the function mapping for this train. If I switch to my PR3, there, now I'm on my PR3 with the train. Um, this is the function mapping and it shows that F0 is uh, for my front headlights and F0 yellow is for my rear headlights. So I've got this hooked up on there. This is my, my front, uh, positive and negative, or the common and the, the negative. And uh, I don't know what's going on. I can't get it. So uh, check out the Tsunami lighting. And uh, that's what I've changed it to. I mean, it was already on dyno light. Um, it was already on use for phase A normal, which is what I want. Uh, as you can see, I changed the headlight F0 light L2 LED, and uh, that's it. That's all I've done for changes. I haven't changed the rear yet because I haven't hooked anything up to the rear. And these are gonna be my F5 and F6 functions, which will be uh, used for my front and uh, rear lights LEDs. Um, for separate uh, use, but anyways, I don't want to ramble too much. Very simple question. Um, does anyone know what I'm doing wrong or what I need to change to be able to make it so my light will shut off with the function zero um, uh, and make it shut off when I go into reverse because I don't want my headlight on when I'm going backwards because my plan is to hook up my red LEDs to the front of the train. So when it's going backwards, the red LEDs are on the back, shining back. So that's what I want. Uh, if anyone can help me out with that, 
that's kind of the step I'm at right now in the middle of this uh, project and not sure what I need to do. Thank you.